Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back once again. It is me, Molt. So happy to be here with you guys as always. And today we're doing a video that we actually haven't done in a while. This is going to be a, a base review video. If you guys want a chance to get your base reviewed, go ahead and send a screenshot of your base. Make sure it's high res so that I can zoom in on it to base reviews with Molt at gmail.com and make sure that the title of it is your town hall number and your level. So town hall seven, level 63 would be uh, the case in Nick right here. Um, but understand that not everybody's going to get reviewed. I have about a thousand emails in there right now and I just go through and pick some that look different so that everybody can learn from it because whether you get your personal base reviewed or somebody else's base gets reviewed, everybody can learn something from it. So why don't we go ahead and jump in to this first one um, with Nick. Let me make sure that my uh, pin is working. Yep, so Town Hall 7, obviously. Uh, farming base, because you can see his clan castle's in the middle, which is perfect. That's exactly where you want it. Um, his wizards are on opposing sides, which is good, because that way um, they help cover the <coughs> his storages, which are right here and here. So those, uh, those are covered somewhat well by the, uh, by the wizard towers. Uh, his mortars are triangulated as well. They are kind of in an awkward uh, position. I would almost uh, rather see this mortar right here somewhere over here um, because if it was indeed right here where this gold storage was, then that would be a better triangle that helps cover the base. Right now it's kind of like this, so the whole top portion of the base up here isn't necessarily covered. So <clears throat> if I were you, I would consider moving this over here um, for sure. So that's the first thing I would move around. I wouldn't move around the wizards. I think those are fine. Um, you got archer, cannon, cannon, archer, cannon, archer, cannon, archer, cannon, archer, all the way around. So that's good. And good job with that. Um, everything looks like it's upgraded really well. You've got a whole bunch of gold. All your walls are maxed out for Town Hall 7. Looks like you are going to be moving up. Uh, fairly soon. In fact, I'm sure that you have already moved up since this uh, picture was sent to me. Um, uh, but yeah, let me, uh, sorry, I got distracted by Skype. <laughs> um, <clears throat> so this looks good. I don't think I would really change too much about it. Um, your traps are out here, right here, and right here, and right here, which is perfect because those are placed right around the defenses. So that looks really good. I don't think I'd really change anything about this except for this the placement of this mortar right over here. Um, let's move on to uh, adorable uh, VB. Um, so this looks like a pretty good Town Hall 7 base. It is a trophy base. Um, personally, at Town Hall 7, I wouldn't necessarily push for trophies. I would try and get as much loot as possible. But with a trophy pushing base, um, the design of this isn't too bad. The wizards are in here protecting the center core, which is good, and they're on opposing sides. Uh, your mortars are triangulated, which is good. Uh, however, this one and this one are pretty exposed um, from attacks from right here because there's no walls in front and then right here. So I would almost consider putting one of the mortars right here. That way these are in the way and then putting one of the mortars right here. That way these walls are in the way as well. And then if that's the case, you can see that it would still be a pretty good triangle. So that's one thing that I would do um, in that regard. So yeah, the mortars look good, the wizards look good, um, the Teslas look good, there's a whole bunch of traps in the middle. I'm pretty sure people can spawn right here though. So uh, I could be wrong, but I'm almost positive somebody can spawn there. So I would probably, uh, switch that up um, because if they can spawn there it's raining great it's freaking raining <laughs> if they can spawn here then these air traps are dumb nobody's gonna I can't imagine anybody just dropping a bunch of dragons in there or anything like that um, <clears throat> so yeah let's go ahead and see so we have cannon archer cannon cannon oh cannon Archer, Archer. So let's go ahead and see where all of your archers are. So you got an archer right here, an archer right here. Oh, I didn't see this one. An archer right here, an archer right here. So that's good. Your archers are in good position. Um, yeah, I don't know what else I would really change. I would just be cautious of this little area in the middle 
Um, so yeah, but why don't we go ahead and move on? Again, that's a, a pretty good base. So yeah, good job with that. Um, level 56, let's move on. Here we go, this base looks pretty cool actually. Um, you do have a lot to upgrade still, but that's fine. Um, so it is a trophy pushing base right there. Air defenses are in the center, and then you have your uh, other uh, air bombs on the side, which looks awesome. Those definitely do a good job of protecting. Um, let's find all your archers. So archer, 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 archer. So you got a pretty big window right around here that doesn't have any archer coverage in it. Um, so I would almost consider, uh, well, I guess you can't really do too much about it because of this, but you have two cannons right next to each. So this whole side of the base doesn't have much air defense. If somebody drops off a couple of minions right here, uh, they can probably take all of this out without having any trouble. Um, same with this side. <clears throat> so I would just be cautious of that. Maybe bring these cannons, maybe bring the cannons right here or something and switch those around. Uh, just try it out because I wouldn't put two cannons next to each other like this. Um, but otherwise the base looks pretty good. Your mortars are triangulated um, and they definitely cover the entire base. You've got your clan castle in the middle. That's awesome. Good job with that. Um, traps are in a good spot. Uh, these traps probably don't work uh, because no uh, defense is going to go towards those or no attacker. Like Giants are going to go right there. Giants are going to go right here and Giants are going to go right here. So I might consider moving these traps right here and right here um, and then try and have the Giants go uh, that way. But otherwise, yeah, I don't see... Uh, Anything wrong with it? I definitely like the design. Um, you're just going to need to uh, probably figure out something to do with these archers because they are spread out a little bit. And we're going to move on to the last base right here. Uh, it is Danny level 58. So um, again, another trophy base. You got your mortars right here, which is great. Uh, and then you got your wizards on either sides. Um, <clears throat> so those look really good. And looks like the center area is protected pretty well. You've got archer cannon archer cannon archer cannon archer cannon so that looks great uh you don't need to change any of that placement um teslas look good out there and you got your spring traps in there to help protect that that's good you could consider putting the spring traps right here and right here um but that's up to you it depends on which side of the base gets attacked the most so you have two spring traps in there you got a spring trap right here and a spring trap right there that looks good i think this base design actually looks um pretty good it looks like it'd be pretty efficient um let's see what else we got air defenses on opposing sides uh that probably have a radius about that big maybe so the whole base is covered pretty well with those um Clan Castle is a little bit exposed, <clears throat> and if I were you, actually here's something that I would definitely do. As you can see right now, you're trying to protect your town hall and your loot. Uh, you got to choose. You have to choose. Uh, in my opinion, if you want to be effective at one of them, you either got to go straight up trophy base or straight up farming base. Um, so I might even consider bringing your elixir out here and putting your wizard towers right in here or um, even doing uh, this, putting a wizard tower right here and a wizard tower right here, and then just moving this gold storage right down here and putting your elixir storages uh, right out here. So um, yeah, let's go ahead and uh, finish this up. I think that that's all that we are going to do. That's gonna be the last base design. Looks really great. Again, guys, those are all Town Hall 7 bases. If you guys want a chance to get reviewed, go ahead and send your base a high-res picture to basereviewswithmolt at gmail.com and make sure that the subject line says town hall blank and your level. Uh, you can also, if you want to, include trophy or farming into that so that it'll help me out a little bit more. Uh, also, if you guys don't get picked, don't get upset. There's thousands of people that want to be picked. So just try and learn from these as best you can. But that's going to be it for this episode, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I really, really do appreciate it. You guys rock. And as always, I'm going to need you guys to make sure that you keep calm and clash on for me, right? I'll see you guys later.